The eighth running of the greatest race in the history of spring once again saw the best in modified racing attempt to qualify for the 80 lap feature event. In fact, nearly 100 teams tried to qualify. One driver missing from the pit area though was remembered at the start of the event as the inaugural spring sizzler winner Fred DeSero passed away after an accident at the end of the 1978 season. DeSero had not only won the first running of the spring sizzler, but also had five top 10 finishes in the event in seven years. While car owner Len Bowler entered the famed three car, it did not compete, instead using the number 30 with Leo Cleary behind the wheel. In qualifying, it was two-time defending sizzler winner Maynard Troyer setting the fast time. Four tenths of a second separated the top 20. The top 10 would be inverted for the start of the race, giving P1 to SJ Avonson and his no-style racing team number 01. Ray Miller would start second. Avonson would lead the opening nine laps before Ron Bouchard took his turn to front of the field after starting eighth. Bobby V would challenge Bouchard for the lead on lap 16 and was able to lead for two circuits before Troyer found his way to the point from his 10th place starting spot. The 80 lap race saw eight cautions claiming several of the early race favorites. Dick Case hit the wall on lap 33, while engine failures claimed Bugsy Stevens, John Rosati, and the pulse hitter Avonson. There was some pit strategy as well during a lap 30 caution with Ron Bouchard taking fresh tires. Under green, Bouchard was coming through the field turning lap times quicker than Troyer the leader, allowing Ron to move into second spot. But after 17 laps of cat and mouse racing and a few cautions as well, Troyer took the checkered flag leading the final 62 laps en route to his third consecutive Spring Sizzler victory. Bouchard would finish a close second, while Ed Flemke finished third. The win would be the sixth and final victory for Troyer at Stafford. Mark your calendars for the 50th running of the greatest race in the history of Spring for Sunday, April 24th. The 100 lap open modified event will culminate a busy weekend of racing that also includes the Napa Auto Parts dual qualifying races and the past super late model 75 on Saturday, April 23rd. See the full schedule and order your tickets today at StaffordSpeedway.com.